Albertus Magnus, also known as Saint Albert the Great, was a German Dominican friar, philosopher, scientist, and bishop. The Catholic Church commemorates his feast day every November 15. Albert was born sometime before 1200, possibly in 1193 in Lauingen, now in Bavaria. He was probably educated at the University of Padua, where he received instruction in Aristotle's writings. Tradition suggests that a vision with the Blessed Virgin Mary convinced him to enter the Holy Orders. So in 1223, he became a member of the Dominican Order. He became a lecturer where the Dominicans had a house in Cologne, Regensburg, Freiburg, Strasbourg, and Hildesheim. In Cologne, Albert wrote his Summa de Bonner. In 1245, Albert became a master of theology and was able to teach theology at the University of Paris as a full-time professor, holding the seat of the Chair of Theology at the College of St. James. During this time, Thomas Aquinas became his student. Albert was also the first to comment on virtually all of Aristotle's writings making him accessible to wider academic debate. This study also allowed him to comment on the teachings of Muslim academics bringing him into the heart of academic debate. In 1254, Albert became the provincial of the Dominican order. During his tenure, he publicly defended the Dominicans against attacks by the secular faculty of the University of Paris, commented on John the Evangelist, and answered the errors of the Islamic philosopher Averroes. In 1259, Albert took part in the general chapter of the Dominicans at Valenciennes which established a program of studies for the Dominicans that featured the study of philosophy as an innovation for those not sufficiently trained to study theology. The following year, Pope Alexander IV made him Bishop of Regensburg. During his term, he refused to ride a horse, traversing his huge diocese on foot. In 1263, Pope Urban IV asked him to preach the Eighth Crusade in German-speaking countries. He was later known as a mediator between conflicting parties. In Cologne, he was known not only for being the founder of Germany's oldest university, but also for the Big Verdict of 1258, bringing an end to the conflict between the citizens of Cologne and the Archbishop. Among the known heartaches Albert had during his lifetime was the defense of the orthodoxy of his former pupil, Thomas Aquinas, who died in 1274, a couple of years ahead of his demise. His health started to decline in 1278. On the 15th of November 1280, Albert died in the Dominican convent in Cologne, Germany. His body was claimed to be incorrupt at the first exhumation three years after his death. Albert was beatified in 1622. He was canonized and proclaimed a doctor of the church on December 16, 1931, by Pope Pius XI. During his lifetime, he became a scientist, philosopher, astrologer, theologian, spiritual writer, ecumenist, and diplomat. It was for this reason that he was made the patron saint of natural scientists in 1941. For more information about every saints and their feast day, please like and subscribe to our channel, House of Prayers for Everyone.